Now, our first story is for the election in Thailand. Thaksin Sinawarta was the first Thai politician to ever win an election outright. And now his daughter, Payetong Tarn Sinawarta, has become a popular favorite as the country's next prime minister. That's right, she is a powerful reminder of her father, the man who changed Thai politics forever. <laughs> She has confidence and charisma, but most of all, she has the name. Pai Tong Tan Shinawatwa is the one way popular favorite as Thailand's next prime minister. As she currently tops every opinion poll since the election was called in March, she is inevitably a powerful reminder of her father, former Premier Thaksin Shinawatwa, the man who changed Thai politics forever. Thaksin Shinawatwa was the first Thai politician ever to win an election victory outright. The billionaire telecoms tycoon brought in populist policies that won him the enduring devotion of the poor. But the country's elites saw his popularity as a threat to their position. In 2006, the army overthrew him amid claims of corruption. He now lives abroad to avoid jail term imposed by his ouster. But there are fears that if his youngest daughter wins the election, Thailand could return into a familiar cycle of protest and military intervention. Either way, putting Pai Tong Tan Shinawatra in a leadership role has benefited the pro Thai party. She has been doing so well in the polls that her party is hoping for a landslide victory and the right to name the prime minister. Uh, she uh, connects uh, with the, the, the electorate, uh, the, the, the base, and she also has, I think, some talent that may have uh, uh, been inherited from her father in terms of uh, going out on stump speeches, connecting with voters, uh, speaking in front of large crowds and, um, and running a campaign, you know, while being pregnant. Uh, so uh, she is definitely a, a, a prime minister material. Thailand's electoral system means that even if Pao Thai wins a majority of seats, he does not automatically name the prime minister. That's up to joint vote of both houses of parliament. And one of those houses, the deeply conservative Senate, is likely to oppose her. A lot of people love them, but you have a large number of conservative people who are against uh, Thaksin and his family. So the fact that he put his, his daughter for the candidate, you know, might turn off a lot of uh, conservative people and can stir up emotion from conservative side again. A strong Thai performance would threaten the military's hold on power that is ongoing for nine years. Recently, Pai Tong Tan dismissed the chances of another violent takeover of the government. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not the one who invented a coup d'etat or anything, but actually, I have a very high hope that it's not going to happen again. And I believe that it's going to be harder, a lot harder, that, that the coup will happen again. This week, after campaigning while heavily pregnant, Pai Tong Tan gave birth to a son whom she showed to the media. It was a rare moment of calm for what looks to be a tense and testing period.